My name is Emma Hippolyte, and I'm a member of parliament in the government of St. Lucia. I'm the Minister for Commerce, Business Development, Investment and Consumer Affairs. And I'm the parliamentary representative for Grosily, which is in the north of the country. I became a member of parliament in 2011. And during that time, during my campaign for political office, I was a victim of political harassment. A member of the opposition United Workers Party during a public meeting focused on my private life and not on my ability to contribute to the development of my country. My response was to remain quiet because I did not feel that I wanted to get down to that level. I knew before I came into office the contribution I could make and the person that I am. And I remain true to that. I came into office to serve my people, and I remain true to that up to today. Now, what are some of the things I believe we can do together uh, to eliminate such? I believe that the whole issue of public education and discussion on the subject of political harassment must be done, not only in St. Lucia, but throughout the region. I believe as well that persons who present themselves a political office should receive proper training. I also believe that political parties should agree to a code of conduct during election and after election. And I believe that institutions such as Pal America, the training that they provide to us is vital and I want to take this opportunity to thank them. I also want to thank institutions such as CIVIL for the mentoring program and the training that they have provided and support that they have provided to women parliamentarians. So with all of this, I commit myself to working in these institutions and within my own parliament and country to eliminate political harassment.